Let's talk a bit about how and why I just sent a letter to my future self. Hey guys, welcome back to Tifero and in this video I want to talk a bit about why I just sent a letter to my future self and how I did that. So there's this website called futureme.org and before anything else I just want to say this isn't a promotional video or anything like that, I've never spoken to people who own the place. I just want to show you guys this because I think there's a reason that this could be very helpful for self-development people like myself. So yeah, let's get on it. Futureme.org is a website where you can write a letter to yourself in the future. You put in your email, you write your letter, or your email rather, and then you pick a date in the future, and on that date, that email will come to you. Uh, now you have to put your own email address because you have to actually verify it afterwards to prove that you've asked for this email to be sent in the future. Um, but this is really useful because think about it. If you are a self-development person, you're constantly working on yourself, constantly improving yourself. So looking back at how you were in the past is a very valuable reminder of how far you've come and it can make you really feel grateful and really feel proud of yourself for how much you've done. So if you, for example, write yourself, write down where you are today, you know, how much you're earning, what job you're working, what you're doing each day, what your routine is, what you're eating, how much you weigh, uh, how much you can bench press or stuff like that. If you write all of that down and put that in an email on futureme.org and then you set it to come a year from now, and then you read that email a year from now after you've progressed and you're now you know, on a healthier diet, you're now earning more money, you're now happier and all of this, then you're going to see all that stuff from a year ago and you're just going to be like wow and you're going to be really grateful. And it's a great way to keep track of your progress because a lot of the time you know, we have sight of future goals but we don't have a clear sight of the things we've already accomplished. They kind of fade out in the background over time and we can't remember you know, when we were this particular weight or uh, when... Uh, we earn this particular amount of money, we can't remember those details. So I think this is a really cool way that we can actually keep track of that. And what I've done is, uh, a week or two ago, I wrote an email to myself. I included everything from my daily routine, to what I'm eating, how much I weigh, uh, how much muscle ma mass I have, uh, the books I'm reading at the minute, you know, the music that I like at the minute, uh, all sorts of these things and I wrote this all down in an email on future me and I told it to come on my birthday in 2019 so that's uh, so that's bleh, can't even count the minute three years and seven months away and in that time you know I'm sure that I'm gonna progress a lot and I'm sure I'm gonna look about look back at it like all confused and uh, it's actually gonna be funny for you guys if any of you guys are still watching then because I've actually put in a bit in that letter about you know my YouTube statistics at the time and also I put in some stuff I, I basically put a reminder in the letter to read it out on my channel when I get it so you know if anyone sticks around all the way till 2019 then you have that to look forward to it's gonna be a bit trippy <laughs> to, to see that to say the least and yeah I suggest you guys do that write down where you are in, in your life at the minute and, and maybe even write down what your goals for for the future would be and write that all down and send that to your future self and try and be positive about it. I see, I've see. i read some other letters on futureme.org because um, some of the letters you can choose to make your letter public. I chose to make mine private. I didn't I didn't necessarily want I, random people getting identifying details about me if I left any in there. But you can make the letter public and a lot of people do. And a lot of these letters, you just read them and it's like, uh, I'm guessing you probably gave up on this. I'm guessing you probably failed all this by now. And all, all really kind of sad, like, uh, depressing letters, but in reality you should look forward to your future positively because if you look forward to your positive future and you set yourself high standards then you're more likely to achieve them. So you know, get excited and tell yourself that you really are going to be amazed when you look back at this letter seeing how you were, you know, a year ago, two years ago, three years ago. And in fact, you know, if you, if you guys actually want to want to join in the challenge a bit and uh, any of you are thinking that you're actually going to stick around that long, you know, three years, then I challenge you to send yourself a future letter uh, that's going to come on August 16th, 2019, that's my birthday in 2019, and in the letter put a reminder at the top, you know, to go to Tifero and type in, you know, some of the cool stuff that you saw in your letter, and you know, put in how you are today, and then what you can do is, when I re release that video in three years or whatever, uh, I'll make, you know, I'll, I'll read my letter to you guys and then in the comments you can post down your letters and how much you've improved and stuff since then. What do you guys think about that?
try that out, you know, go to futureme.org, I'll put a link to it up there or over there or sort of somewhere on the screen uh, and check that out and, you know, write yourself a letter to August 16th, 2019. And remember to include the bit, you know, to go to Tiffero and share the letter so you don't forget that part. Um, and if you, if you don't want to do one that long, then, you know, do one for a year or something. But if you do that one for 2019 and August 16th, then we can all share them together and we can all, you know, learn a bit from each other's experiences. So yeah, that's been a bit about Future Me, and I think it's a really cool idea, you should check it out. Um, if you liked the video, and if you want more similar self-development content, then remember to subscribe up there, because we've got regular videos that come out every Wednesday and Saturday, and help you with all sorts of things. If you like the video, leave a thumbs up. Uh, if you have any comments, or maybe you want to share you know, a future letter that you've already got, if you've used this site before, or maybe you want to share the one that you're writing now, then share that down in the comments below. If you want to keep watching, check out the video up there. Take care, guys.